When you close your eyes and imagine the kind of place that rapper ASAP Rocky comes home to after a long, hard day of work, what do you see? Is it a stylish, multi-million dollar home located in a swanky neighborhood like LA's WeHo Beverly Cove area? Or maybe it's a lofty penthouse looking out across the vast vista of old London town in the UK. Wait, what? ASAP Rocky lives in London? Well, in just a moment, we're gonna see exactly where the rapper does call home. In these videos, we don't reveal any addresses, and even though I've done a house tour of my own place, please do not show up at any private residences because it's not safe for anyone. ASAP Rocky is a rapper with a net worth of $10 million, and yes, apparently this frontman of the ASAP mob has turned all of his musical success into a pair of homes on both sides of the ocean. I mean, how else would you expect him to woo an endless parade of women over the years? Be it Iggy Azalea, Chanel Iman, or even his most recent boo, Rihanna, ASAP Rocky knows how important it is to have a comfortable place to Netflix and chill. Or whatever it is millionaire hip hoppers do with their even more successful lady partners. Hey guys, it's Kara the Vampire Slayer back with another exclusive host tour here on Famous Entertainment, this one looking at where ASAP Rocky calls home. Be sure to like, subscribe, and follow me on Instagram to chat. And now, let's get into this video. Back in the early stages of 2015, ASAP Rocky picked himself up his very first starter home for just over $3 million. According to property records, the home was sold to Ricky Trust, the trust fund that Rocky named after his older brother Ricky, who lost his life when the rapper was only 13. Like most of the houses built in the area known as West Hollywood or Beverly Grove, the exterior of this home is box-like in structure. However, once you get inside, this modern casa has boatloads of space thanks to its open floor. Plan. In fact, the entire ground floor is really nothing more than one giant room. Those massive wooden front doors open up to reveal white oak flooring alongside some complimentary and endless rows of built-in lighting. Only a few feet away from there is the living and family room area. It features a colossal fireplace and a sunken conversation area where Rocky no doubt spends many romantic nights with Riri. In fact, this exquisite space is so large that the nearby dining table looks pretty minuscule in comparison to the rest of the room and might need something of an upgrade. I mean, it's not like he can't afford it. Further inside, the minimalist kitchen has all the necessary designer appliances, not to mention an olive green and blonde wood paint scheme that shouldn't work, and yet it does. I would say this kitchen is pretty charming. Meanwhile, on the top floor of Rocky's 4,321 square foot house are all five of the home's bedrooms, including his gray and cream colored master suite. While it may look sparse in terms of decoration, I'm sure by now ASAP has decked all of those walls out with some killer art pieces and designer furnishings. Rounding off the top floor is a somewhat unusual open sky patio lounge that comes complete with its very own fireplace and a few hanging plants. Damn, no matter what floor of the house, this man sure knows how to set a mood, doesn't he? Moving outside at the rear of the home is a snug backyard that the developer still somehow managed to squeeze a zero-edge plunge pool and spa combo into. Oh, and did I mention the patch of grass that's just barely large enough for any pests to do their business? But as nice as this home is, the best part is its centrally positioned location. Beverly Grove sits in a prime piece of real estate just between Melrose Avenue and Beverly Boulevard. That means it's always within walking distance to some of the most unbelievable storefront shopping in the world, not to mention some killer restaurants. That last point is something that I'm no doubt sure Riri appreciates whenever she's spending the night at Rocky's. In fact, just recently, the Umbrella singer was seen exiting Rocky's home wearing an outfit composed of neon green pants and a lilac sweater vest, alongside a matching green patterned bucket hat. It's basically the type of outfit that only Riri could somehow make look as casual as she does. In terms of their history, Rihanna and Rocky have known one another since 2012 when Rocky worked on a remix of Riri's hit song, Cockiness. Then they struck up their relationship in 2020 after Rihanna had broken up with her then boyfriend, billionaire Hassan Jamil. 
Sure, Rocky might not be a billionaire, but I mean, you just saw the guy's house. I mean, he's doing more than all right for himself. Better yet, Rocky seems to truly be in love. If a recent interview with GQ is anything to go by, Rocky is smitten with Riri, telling the magazine that relationships are so much better when you get the one, and that she amounts to probably like a million of the other ones. That's most definitely sweet, but also a lot of pressure. So whatever you do, Rocky, maybe don't tell Rihanna about that time your house was broken into and you had nearly $2 million worth of goods stolen. That's right, in May of 2017, a few years before Rocky would start dating Rihanna, he was the victim of a break-in. Thankfully, the world-famous rapper wasn't there at the time, but unfortunately, someone else was. According to reports of the incident, a female relative of Rocky's had been staying at the rapper's home. When this individual returned to the Beverly Grove home at around 11.30 at night, she was met by three suspects, one of whom was armed with a handgun. The suspects demanded the woman open Rocky's safe, but since she didn't have the combination, the criminals simply decided to try and take the safe with them, along with approximately $1.5 million worth of jewelry and other items. While in the process of trying to steal the safe, the criminals were scared off by some of Rocky's neighbors, who saw the whole thing going down. Thankfully, Rocky's guest wasn't harmed at all during the ordeal. As for where Rocky stays when he isn't spending the night in his Beverly Grove home, well, it's not like he doesn't have options. Not only could he stay at any one of Riri's killer palaces with her, which you can check out the details of in our Rihanna house tour, but he's also apparently got his very own penthouse suite in the posh district of Mayfair in London, England. During a recent interview with Tim Westwood, ASAP not only revealed that he messes with London, but he loves the place so damn much he just had to pick up a permanent spot all his own. It appears like the biggest selling point when it comes to London town is how little anyone in the area cares about Rocky, which is probably a refreshing change of pace from LA, where he's mobbed wherever he goes. As for where exactly this home is located and all of its wonderful details, well, Rocky is keeping those under tight wraps. He's only been willing to reveal that he bought a place, not much else. Meanwhile, a recent interview with Billboard was described as having taken place inside of an apartment in Mayfair, so we know that it's not a townhouse. In fact, during that interview, ASAP told Billboard that he's been living in London on and off since 2014, telling them, London is my home away from home. So there you have it, that's gonna bring our ASAP Rocky house tour to a close. We got to take a look at the rapper's stunning home in Beverly Grove, Los Angeles, and what we know about his hideaway across the pond. And while it isn't much, we know it's there. So what did you guys think? What was your favorite part of ASAP's house in LA? I like how they managed to fit a cute little pool in the yard as well as the open concept floor plan. Do you think there's any chance his place in Mayfair is as nice as his home in LA? Hopefully one day we'll get to find out. Be sure to let me know your thoughts down in the comments. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram and I will see you all in the next video. Bye.